Hey there, welcome to Proud Animator. In this video, we are going to learn how to animate fingerprint unlock animation in After Effects. So let's start. We are inside of After Effects and this is the illustration we are going to use in today's lesson. So this is the pattern of the fingerprint. I am selecting all the layer and let's pre comp it. Ok, now I am going to select all these layers and convert it into shape layer. Now I am going to convert this circle into shape layer again. Now let's animate this fingerprint pattern so get inside this precomp and i'm going to open up this layer and go come over here in add and select trim path and we are going to open it again and animate the end so put a keyframe on end and i'm going to jump on to next six frame and let's give it zero and let's reverse the keyframe order so right click on it go to keyframe assistant and time reverse keyframes and let's easy as it by selecting the keyframe and pressing f9 perfect all right so i'm going to copy this trim path and select this layer and just control v control plus v to paste it in all of these layers so the trim paths have been added in all of these layers with the keyframe so let's offset it by two to three frames okay so all of these key layers have been offset by four frames now let's check our animation yeah it's looking perfect so right now we are going to add this trim path in the circle as well so let's copy it and paste it over here but this time around we are going to select the last keyframe and we are going to drag the keyframe where this fingerprint animation ends so it will be around here so let's check our animation we can do one more thing we can start this from here so for that go to trim path and just offset it and start it from here perfect so right now i want to speed up the animation a bit so i'm going to enable the time remapping and put a keyframe over here let's select both of these keyframes and pull it few frames earlier okay and i'm also going to ease these time remapping keyframes so let's check our animation yep it's looking even better now let's animate the stroke width of this circle so i'm going to select the stroke of this circle and add a keyframe on the stroke width and jump onto the last keyframe and add a keyframe over here as well so at this point let's decrease the width and at this point let's increase it perfect i'm also going to add keyframe on the color property and also over here as well so at this point the color will change to somewhat green perfect now let's copy this circle and pull it down and let's get rid of all the keyframes so let's decrease and lighten up the color a bit perfect and open the opacity and add a keyframe and let's jump on to next 10 frame and add a keyframe at this point the opacity will be zero so when the fingerprint scanner completes the scanning the whole thing will uh, the whole thing will cover up with a fill let's add a fill over here because there wasn't any fill added 
so after that let's copy this color and paste it over here and let's get rid of the stroke and let's lighten up the fill a bit perfect even we can make it appear a bit before perfect okay so now i'm going to add a tick over here when this fingerprint animation ends there will be a tick animated over here so i'm using the pen tool and added a tick and uh, let's change the anchor point and put it over here and let's put it exactly at the center and rescale a bit perfect and uh, let's rename it now let's go inside the stroke i'll change this one to rounded cap and rounded joint perfect and i'm going to add trim path over here add a keyframe on the end and jump on to next 15 frame and let's give it zero percent and let's reverse the keyframe order it's looking pretty nice now now let's add animation to this lock so open the position property and i'm going to add keyframe when this whole pattern animation completes so somewhere over here and also i'm going to jump on to next two frame and then i'm going to add the position and let's jump on to next 10 frame and add a position over here let's split it because we are going to animate only in the y-axis so let's drag it upwards perfect now let's jump on to three frames or four frames and let's add a keyframe and at this point i'm going to go even further and let's just uh, overshoot the keyframe and let's check our animation perfect okay so like this you can animate a fingerprint unlock in after effects so that is it for this lesson hope you liked it if you liked it then make sure to hit the like button if you have any doubt regarding the lesson make sure to comment down below i will be happy to help you out and if you are here for the first time make sure to subscribe the channel and hit the bell notification button to stay notified for all the future updates until then goodbye